I'm going to discuss maintenance that you should be doing to your BX and the mower throughout the summer. I'm going to start out by talking about maintenance that you should be doing after every mowing. You only need two basic tools, a grease gun and a blow nozzle for your air compressor. If you don't have an air compressor, you could use a leaf blower or you could use a shop vac on the blow setting. After every mowing, I like to blow the engine off. Most importantly, you need to remove your radiator screen and blow it out. Sometimes you can shake it and get most of it. Like that time it cleaned up pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and blow the engine off now. And now that the radiator screen is removed, it's a good time to blow out the radiator. On a BX, your radiator is mounted at the rear. The fan is right here. So it's drawing the air in this direction. You want to blow from the front to the rear in the opposite direction to blow all the trash out of the radiator. I'm using a long blow nozzle with a rubber tip. And I can get down in at the radiator really well with it. Believe it or not, I do do this after every mowing, even though there's all that dust blowing out. And now I will reinstall the radiator screen. Handle goes over to the right. I'm also going to remove this screen here because it's dirty. I don't remove this after every mode because it usually doesn't get that dirty but you can actually see it's kind of like greenish yellow from all the pollen Now that the engine and most importantly the radiator have been blown off, I'm just going to blow the whole tractor off quickly. Now I'm going to let the deck down so I can remove these guards to clean the deck off thoroughly. Watch when you remove it because there are two washers on it. Now here's what the deck looks like with the guards off. See there's some grass. Usually it's packed pretty bad in here. This side's got a bunch of grass on it. I like to remove the grass because I feel like it'll help hold moisture and maybe make the deck rust up quicker plus if you keep your tractor inside it'll stink up the building where you keep it so now I'll use a long blow nozzle again to blow everything off
All right, now the deck is clean. So now's a good time to check your belt, make sure there's no cracks or tears in it. Then also, Kubota recommends changing the seal, the bottom seal in the gearbox every two years. This tractor is five years old and has never had the seal changed in it. I just keep a close watch on the fluid and also when I blow the tractor off, I can look and tell that there's no oil laying on the deck, there's no dirt collected around it from an oily residue, and then the tractor is parked inside and there's never any leakage from it. So by doing that, I know I'm good to go, but you should keep a close watch on your fluids. Now I will reinstall the covers. You also want to check and make sure that the cooling fins on the hydro are clear of debris. If you look right there, close to the front of the floorboard, that little white thing on the screen is the fan. And behind it are the cooling fins for the hydro. So you want to be sure that there's no grass or dirt in them. Then back under the hood, I like to remove my air filter since I'm working in dusty conditions and blow it out every week. You can at least check yours to get a feel of how often you need to blow it out. You might be able to get by two or three weeks where you live. It's gonna vary depending on how much mowing you do. You'll wanna regulate your air down to 30 PSI to blow air filter out. If you're using too much pressure, you can actually blow the pleats apart. Yes, again, this air filter is blown out weekly. It's just very dusty conditions. You also want to squeeze this open on your air cleaner to make sure it's not full of debris. Now, if you look in the owner's manual of your mid-mount mower for these tractors, and look under the maintenance section for greasing, it'll say daily check. So to me, that means grease it daily. But one guy might mow with his tractor for 30 minutes, the next guy might mow six hours a day. So there's a big variation there. So for me, I like to grease the mid-mount mower after every eight to 10 hours of use. That includes all three spindles, the idler pulley, the tensioner, the five gauge wheels, everything on the deck. Also, don't forget to keep an eye on your tire pressure. These tires on these BXs are known to leak air. If your tire pressure gets off, it will throw your deck level off. I also like to take the blades off there every eight hours and sharpen them so that I maintain a good cut quality. So thanks for watching this video. If you found the video helpful, please like it. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments section below. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe.